I felt like I was a date, and I was asking my friends, I don't even really know if I should go. And I had no idea. I thought, like me, she was bright-eyed and bushy-tailed and ready to go meet. And so I didn't know this side of the story. And so I said, hey, I'm going to tell the story on the air. She's like, well, I should at least be able to give my side of it. So I pulled out my iPhone, and I recorded this. So I just told the story about Caitlin not wanting to come and meet me the first time we went out because you were tired or just not into it. But you, but maybe divine intervention. Yeah, I don't. I, it wasn't that I wasn't into it. It was just I, one, didn't know it was a date. And two, I was tired. And three, you your plans kind of kept changing, which wasn't your fault. But um, I didn't think it was a date. So I didn't really think it would be that big of a deal not to come when it was pushed back like two hours further. But yes i do believe in divine intervention but i don't believe that what's meant to be will be i think we all have free choice but i do think that because i am strong in my faith and i have constant communication with god that when i when my heart or my self was like oh, i don't really want to go tonight he keeps pushing the time back just a friend whatever i think that god placed it on my heart like no go you need to go and here so, we are. And here we are. And so I'm, I'm... And I just brought you coffee in bed. Yes, you did. Like Queen Elizabeth. Yeah, it's you Queen Elizabeth to me. Do you guys call it that? No. We like, oh, look who Queen Elizabeth gets their food in bed. She does that to me too. So I had taken her, her coffee this morning before I left for work. What do you think about that? There. I love it. I think it's glad that... Or I'm glad that she felt that nudge to still go even though she was maybe thinking of not why'd you have to push it two hours because we were shooting a show on a uh, to tell the truth game show and i was oh. on there and they kept extending the show i don't know and i was like hey can we move it to here and she was like yeah i never knew she didn't want to come she was like yeah but in her head she's like forget she's, this <laughs> <laughs> she's like i'm tired and then god was like you should go yeah let me throw a big shout out to the man upstairs for making it happen you know I love it. You're making it happen. It's about the show. Hey.